Well, well, hello, Denture family. How are you all doing this evening? I hope that you're faring better than I am. So, I was going to post a little video because I just passed my 14-month E-Day anniversary, and I've been trying to make a video for you since June 11th, which was my actual E-Day one-year anniversary, but a lot's happened, and if you watch my other videos, you've seen that. Anyway, um, so what's going on with all this getup that I have going on here? So, the other night, on Tuesday night, I made dinner for my husband and me, and I served my husband his dinner, and I turned around to come back in the kitchen, and my big, huge golden retriever, golden retriever, Zoe, was laying in the middle of the living room floor. I guess I thought that she was more to the right or left of me. Anyway, my husband just said everything happened so fast. I turned around. The next thing I know, my husband was standing over me, saying, are you all right? And I had the worst stomach pain, and I couldn't breathe. Well, apparently I had tripped over her. And how I fell, my fist went into my abdomen and my sternum, and then knocked the breath out of me, and then somehow I fell to the right. So I have a sprained arm from the shoulder down, sprained wrist, and I'm right-handed. And this is my right hand. Woo -hoo. But nothing is broke. Nothing is majorly ruptured. Um, if you follow my journey, you know back in 2017 I tore my rotor cuff in my left arm and broke my scaphoid bone. So, praise God, that's not going on. I'll be alright. And because I have fibromyalgia, it'll take two to four weeks, maybe six to eight weeks to heal up. Maybe faster, just depends. I got my prayer warriors working on my praying. So, because I have spinal stenosis in my neck and my spine, any kind of fall or shove can give me whiplash, so that's why the collar. And I got my sling on right now, mostly when I'm up. When I'm, when I'm go lay down, I take this off and put ice packs on it in my TENS unit. So, my uh, video that I was going to make, my mukbang video of me eating different foods with my dentures, um, is going to have to be put on hold. And um, today, I couldn't even put the teeth in because, hello, I'm right-handed, and my husband's working. So, it makes it a little difficult, um, and everything. I can use this arm, it just, it hurts. So, I, today I decided, you know what, no dentures. And besides, the other night, I was napping, and I bit my lip eight, nine times in a row with my dentures. So, anyway, um... Haven't got in for my second hard reline yet because of COVID-19. As you all know, that's all been put on hold. So, doing the best I can with adhesive. Um, and uh, the top one isn't fitting as snug. But, um, you know, sorry, my sister's texting me and I it dropped down. So, sorry about that. Um, she hasn't been feeling well. My baby sister, she lives in Oregon and um, she's had some symptoms similar to COVID. So... Anyway, um, but I just wanted to come on here, and um, since I'm on, um, before I called you guys, I thought, well, I've had so much trouble with gumming food because of my digestive issues, so I'm not that good at gumming solid foods, mostly the things that just dissolve. So I made me some guacamole here, left-handed, and I'm not left-handed, I'm right-handed, as I said, and... Um, so before I did a test run on this, before I, um, before I, um, started to video, so I just wanted to show you guys, look what I could do, and I have no teeth in, um, so yeah, here we go. Mmm, mmm. I'm trying, been trying to toughen up my gums, but like I said in my past videos with digestive issues, it's hard. 
sorry. I'm trying not to talk with those chips in there. But anyway, I just want to come on. Let you guys know. I'm going to be out of commission for just a little bit to heal. But I'll get back on as soon as I'm feeling better. Because I'm in pain. And um, I can't take pain meds. So I'm taking my essential oils and I'm rubbing them on me and I'm taking them with a shot of water. And um, today, since my husband had to work, I basically just warmed up a couple things. I ate some of those, you know those snack crackers? Um, they have the cheesy ones with the peanut butter and the other ones that are look like a Ritz cracker with the peanut butter. I ate those without teeth today. Ooh, got them chewed up good. So far, no stomach issues. And so now I'm eating this. And then I had some Dinty more stew. And that's easy to mash up, though. But, yeah, today I just said no teeth because um, my arm hurts too bad to hold and brush and everything. So, like I said, I can use my arm and my wrist. It's just very painful right now, so it needs to rest for a couple of days. So, I'll be back on, and I'll do my mukbang when I feel better. Um, but, yeah, I've made it to the one-year anniversary now, 14 months, as of the 11th of this month. And I just wanted to check in and hop in real quick with you guys and just say hi and um, tell you I'm hanging in there and um, like I said I'm due for the second hard reline and there's nothing I can really do right now so I've just been loading them up with adhesive you know um, not loading loading but you know as much as I need to keep that top one in um, the bottom one that was driving me crazy in the beginning of my journey it's really not driving me that crazy um, but I'm sure they'll feel better when I get my second reline, and then I guess they'll either make them into permanents or they'll recast me. So I'll keep you guys updated on that, and I will um, do a mukbang when I'm feeling better. Um, I'm so excited to show you guys this awesome sandwich I made recently, um, and just to um, share some pictures with with some meals that I've eaten. And I'd like to do like a little mukbang of just eating different things. Um, I don't have DentroFit yet i still am thinking about trying it but i just haven't had the money so well that's where we're all not much not much more to tell you guys um so um i hope you're all doing well you're all in my thoughts and prayers and um remember you can do this stay strong and don't give up i love you denture family Mwah. peace out